With the EasySign Soft Drop Shadow feature, you can easily create a transparent shadow with soft edges. When you want to add the standard drop shadow to this example, first select the object to apply the effect to. Now choose Effects, Shadow, Drop and click Normal. You can also alter the color if you like for a more dramatic effect. Now I want to show you the soft drop shadow on the duplicate object. Once again, go to Effects, Shadow and choose Soft Drop Shadow. The dialog that appears shows an easy and simple overview of all the important settings you may need. Let's start with the X and Y offset values. By setting the horizontal and vertical offset, you control the angle of the shadow. A positive or negative value determines the position. With transparency, you set the percentage of the required drop shadow transparency. The higher the value, the more transparent your shadow will appear. Blur will set the thickness of the shadow's outside border, which will fade into the background. Color obviously sets the shadow's color, while enabling anti-aliasing enhances the dithering of the shadow. The mode setting lets you define the RGB or CMYK color space you need for creating the shadow. The resolution is set to 300 dpi by default, but can be changed to your requirements, depending on the final scale of your design and your necessary output quality. After choosing Apply, the result is displayed instantly. Setting the transparency and blur values to zero results in an ordinary drop shadow like I showed earlier. To demonstrate the effect of increasing blur and the transparency ratio, I will set blur to 1.5 and apply the effect. You can see that the shadow has soft edges now. Changing the transparency ratio enhances the appearance even more. When I change the background to another color you can see it is a transparent shadow with soft edges. You can choose any background color you like. The transparent drop shadow is also suitable to apply on more complex designs like this template. Just choose Effects, Shadow, Soft Drop Shadow and then click Apply. That's right, it's that fast! Ok, let's change this one. We lower the transparency ratio and increase the blur. This will show a much larger shadow, which is clearly fading away in the colored background. By changing the background color, the transparency is applied in a sophisticated way. And that's not all, because a soft drop shadow in EasySign can be exported to Illustrator as well, including all shadows properties. Now choose File, Export, to save the file as PDF. I untick the selection box, uh, because I want to save the whole file. You probably want to preserve the support and transparency, so tick the upper box and choose OK. Now we switch to Illustrator and open the just created PDF file. When you look at the shadow, you will notice that the transparency has been preserved. 